Take your way down I-10 Out to 347 Take the Henderson exit To the landing out there And remember the day when the cypress trees grew thick When the fish were still biting And the land was still free I'm just a Cajun Live in the basin Hunting and trapping and making my ways Grandpa's wrinkled and old like a raisin Life of a coon as he lived your way Daddy would tell you that this place ain't the same and Ain't it a shame that we cut down them trees and I was preaching that sermon my children today can't take them out fishing, no fish in the bay. I needed a job. There's times when you can't make money playing music. I just go out and work for Greg for a week or two. Mom and Greg have always been good friends. I actually wrote a song about Greg probably three or four years ago. I was driving down the road and he was on a radio show talking about when you look out on the interstate and you see all the trees cut. Most people think, man, that's probably always like that. But no, man, there used to be a lot of beautiful trees before they cut all the cypress down. It's full of cypress and oaks and just beautiful wildlife. Everything we see in Aranas now is cypress forest. And from what I heard, the logging companies cut everything. And the only trees we see alive now were either trees that were hollow and still living, but they don't have any wood in them, or young trees that were too small to cut when the logging was going on. I'm a commercial crawl fisherman, for one thing. And then I'm looking for logs at the same time, so I pull out the side for the logs and take them to a sawmill. Oh, yeah, this is Tie some big chunks of styrofoam on it, and then hope that the spring high water will lift it out of the mud. It's floating, Greg. I just like it. It's like a treasure hunt for me out there, you know. So you always find something if you know where to look. Yeah, I think it when it gets a little higher though, it did move. That's a good sign. I mean, that dude financed a car for me basically. He said, look, you got a decent car, 800 bucks. I'm taking half of your pay until you pay it off. Sell that piece of crap truck you got so you can go on the road. And, and it worked out good. So, man, I know he's looking out for me. He's, at, he's offered to loan me a bunch of money to get my CD done, but I'd rather work for it as I go. I don't want to owe anybody a big, big chunk of money, but I know if I need something, man, he'd be there for me. He's a good guy. Blood red paint on a rotten bar. Rooster crowing till he gets his car. There ain't a whole lot I got left to do. Just let me come back home, come back home to you. Summer sun sinking on the green grass plow. Many people that come to Louisiana, the big thing is. Cajun country, Buddha and crackling. There ain't nothing. Did you ever eat rice dressing? It's just the opposite. You know, like the rice dressing, you like you cook it on the stove, but the boudins, you just boil it. You know, like ball the meat, ball onions, rice all together in one, and then you mace it and you put it in a case. Winter wind blowing on a barbed wire fence. We'll 
Cajun? I think it was a politically correct word to keep from saying coon ass. I think the coon asses or people refer to themselves as coon asses. Do you have a skin of coon? Obviously not. Well, the rectum of a coon is tougher than boot leather. And I guess they see it as a metaphor for being tough. Are you a coon ass? Damn right. No choice, but Lord, we wish we had. How we come and cut this farm in half? Sell the land and let them steal it all away. And it was just another piece of real estate. No more cotton on my family farm. Granny never did much like you alone. Daddy said you drank too damn much, had a call. Bailing hay from a rusty truck. And the cows come home to that. 